doesn't really cut any better than a strider does in this type of cut. Surprising, since the tip on the strider is a lot thicker. It's a little bit easier. Stock Edge uh, ZT801. So, told you guys I was gonna use it hard, so I figured I would start now. Lock up good, everything's good to go. So, just gonna shave some wood, see how it does with a stock edge. It doesn't, doesn't bite very well, I can tell you that. Angle definitely needs to be laid back and it could stand to be a little sharper. That's for sure. Hit a little rock there. Kind of par for the course with the stuff I do. It's a good analog for some of the crap that I put my knife through. So we'll see what the edge looks like after slamming into that rock. It's enough wood carving. So lock up is a little bit later. Let's see if it's stuck. No, no stick. No lock rock. Pretty significant roll in the edge. It's right there. I don't know if you can see it. Pretty deep. Uh, it's catching my nail pretty well. So that'll come out in the first sharpening. It's not too bad. But anyway, first little bit of uh, this hard use compilation for this knife. So anyway, thanks guys. So, doing some more cutting with the 801, uh, sharpened it up on the Wicked Edge, it's 17 DPS, and it's uh, pretty much hair whittling, it is hair whittling actually, so it zips right through the paper. Uh, good benchmark to start at, the others were done with a stock edge, so I'm just going to do stuff that I have done recently since I moved into a new home. That's uh, shearing wire, so this is uh, copper wire that I had to shear, and I used my strider for this. And uh, there's some scrap flooring from another home that's being built, so it's a good surface to cut on. And uh, not that hard to do. Takes a little bit of pressure. Since I thinned the edge out, does a little bit better than it did stock. And uh, I don't feel any damage, but we'll see if it... Dulled the edge a little bit, but that's to be expected. It is copper wire, albeit really really small gauge copper wire that didn't really seem to affect the edge on on uh, the strider but it is LMAX and well, such is life so cut a little carpet not not too big or not too weird of a task something a lot of people have to do puppies are freaking out try to make slicing cuts just to Minimize the wear in one spot. Carpet's actually pretty tough to cut. If you've never cut it, it's got some uh, really abrasive stuff in it. So, pretty much lost our edge at this point, which is pretty disappointing. Just to be honest, I mean, that's uh, hair whittling edge to an edge that I can rub on my fingertips. It's pretty. Pretty disappointing, to say the least. My SNG with Z-Wear did 
far more work than this. Far more work and still with sliced paper pretty easily. So I'm gonna go and do something else that my SMG did really easily. Which is try to coat can. And it's lost its edge to the point where it doesn't even really want to get through the coat can, which is surprising because they're fairly easy to cut with a knife that has any edge at all. Pretty disappointed. Yeah, I have uh, I have no edge at all now. Went from hair whittling to to having zero edge and what what's it been three minutes that I've been recording? Mm -hmm. Let's see if it'll still cut. Doesn't really want to cut. It just rips through the cardboard. So. Uh, don't really know what to say about that. That's kind of... I'm actually pretty surprised at how poorly this just held its edge. Uh, uh, I'm kind of... I don't even know what to say at this point. I feel a lot of uh, micro rolling and I can see a lot of edge flattening. So I don't know what causes this with LMAX. But uh, I honestly don't know what to say about this. Hopefully, maybe somebody like Cliff Stamp can uh, shed some light on this because I, I have no clue. And again, I don't want to act like I hate ZT or have an agenda against uh, LMAX because I don't. But uh, the knife performs well. I mean, it cuts well, but it just does not hold an edge whatsoever. So... Anyway, a little bit of cutting, a uh, little short demo. This video ends up probably being five minutes long, so not a whole lot of cutting, but uh, hopefully it gives you an idea of some real-world use.